Hi everyone. So today I'm going to show you. Hi everyone. Today I'm going to show you um, how to upload Word documents to Purple Mash. Okay. So I'll just share my screen with you. Okay. So. When your child is on Purple Mash, they are um, presented with their to do's here, which is in their to do folder. OK, um, when they're asked to complete some work on a dot doc document, what they will need to do is open the document here. OK, so we double click on the document at the bottom. And then it will open in a Word document or a PDF depending on which one the teacher has set and then we open it here okay the child will write their name here so I'll just do mine Miss S and then we will answer the questions I'll just write on here test document okay so in the reading questions the children are asked to follow the link so we control and click to take us through to the YouTube once we've watched the clip we then come back to our Word document OK, and then we need to save this in our area on our computer. So we'll save it to our own computer wherever you want to save it in yours. So I'm just going to put Eye of the Wolf answers Miss S. And save. OK, so once you've answered all the questions, that's how we save the document. We need to make sure it's saved as a Word document, not as any other file type. OK, once that's done, we then go back. To our purple mash area. And we click on upload work. So click on the upload work. Click on download. Go to your documents or wherever you saved it. I saved it in here. Double click on the document. Make sure you close it down first, otherwise it won't allow you to do it. Double click on the document, click done, click OK, and then hand it in. OK, and you can leave a note here for the teacher. Finished my work, please mark, and click OK. Once that's done, the teacher will then receive that document and will be able to mark it and provide feedback for your child. OK. So I hope that helps. Any further questions, please do um, give the office a call or put information on the blog. And I'm in school most days and I'm working from home so I can give you a call if you're struggling. OK, that's the way that all the English documents are now going to be sent. So each day I'll have a, a spelling and grammar piece of work, a writing piece of work and a reading piece of work. And they should all be submitted that way. I hope that helps. Thank you.